All right, wankers, I'm Terry Slimebag, founder of Dream Crusher Management Limited, agent to some of the potential biggest stars in UK show business who haven't made it yet. I don't represent ventriloquists or magicians. I don't even want to watch that shit, let alone manage it. Now, today's news from the comedy world is that two women of colour have had a massive strop and quit an all-female panel show on Comedy Central in protest because producers wanted approval of their material. I mean, they were only booked in the first place because they ticked a load of equality and diversity boxes. That's the downside of critical race theory, isn't it? When you allow certain people to entertain delusions that they're oppressed, you can very quickly turn them into fussy, spoilt, talentless twats with a rancid certainty of their own entitlement. This would never have happened if Comedy Central had hired white blokes, would it? Because white blokes can cope with a stressful working environment without letting their emotions overwhelm them. Also, white blokes know what a joke looks like. I manage a load of white blokes. Most of them are resting at the moment, but it's that sort of business, isn't it? Work comes in patches. I've got this one geezer, Andrew Lawrence, funny bloke, he's a decent turn, but if you meet him off stage, he's a bit of a prick. But back in the day, ten years ago, he was asked to do a ten-week series of Stand Up for the Week on Channel 4, and he hated every living, breathing minute of it. But he didn't quit and strop off like a whiny little bitch. He got his head down, he did his job like a professional. He fulfilled his contractual obligations like a fucking grown-up. He's out on tour now, Camberley tonight, then Siren Sester, Stratford upon Avon, Solihull, Worcester, Guildford, Manchester, Maidstone, London, Whitehaven, Crewe, Eastleigh, Southampton, all the high spots, all the prestige venues. Fuck knows if it'll be any good. He ain't done a gig for a year and a half now, but tickets are cheap. On sale now. Get your wallet out. Support live comedy, you fucking tight ass.